Hi, I welcome all of you in my channel and in this video in which we are going to discuss that how to make the graphs very attractive for the research papers. In reference to my previous videos that are regarding the Taguchi analysis and optimization in which we generate the main effect plots for different response variables as well as signal to noise ratio plots for again the response variables. The graph you are seeing is very quite attractive uh, for the research paper just like I am uh, telling you this is the research paper in which there were five such graphs have been inserted. However, when we generate the graph in the mini tab, it, look, it, it looks like this that is not so much attractive so that we have to make few amendments changing in it. There are few options. One of the option is that we can change the graph like this or it may be look like this. I think this one is the quite attractive as compared to the earlier one. This is the data set for Taguchi L16 orthogonal array and I'm going to draw the first graphs and do the Taguchi analysis. Click on the stat then click on DOE design of experiment. Sorry I'm doing it again stat DOE then Taguchi then analyze Taguchi design. So in this way I am going to select a C6 because my, res, uh, because my response variable RA surface roughness is in the column C6 that has been represented by RA. Then in the option you will have to work out that graphs. So you will say uh, you will select that I need signal to nice ratio plots as well as plots for the means. Then click OK. After that go to analysis. So you need that uh, just response table for means are more than enough terms okay one two three four five all five factors inputs or you can say uh, parameters have been selected for the analysis then go to option so r is surface roughness we need smaller is the better this is the most important thing and click ok and then uh, storage do not select anything okay because if you click on the storage the results will be stored in a column like this and i do not need for this video just I need that how we can generate the plots. So this is the plot for the main effect for means we do not know about which so we have to edit the title as well as well as we get a second plot that is for the response a signal to nice ratios based upon the response variable that is RA. So we will edit the previous graph and we'll make it like this very attractive for the research papers and thesis. So let's start with the heading, double click on the graph. The graph will become in the editable option, then click on this heading. And then it is written in the text, main effects plot for signal to nice ratio, you can add or delete ad anything. So I will write for tensile strength. Okay, then I will say that make it 16. So I will click on the 16 and bold each and everything is okay for me click okay so now it become like this the second thing is that i do not need this word data means so i again double click on it okay i do not need it you can delete it like this or in the second way it is selected the whole text so press the delete button it will be deleted as a whole as you wish you can delete by backspace or by using the by cl clicking on the delete button you can do it now we discuss about the names of the input variables or parameters. So you click on it, then font. You can see that if we make it 16, there is a, this is a very technical point. There I have written the wordings like groove angle making 16 may create problem. Let me check. And if it's create the problem, here the problem is that if you want to increase the text size as there is a lot of alphabets, and the space is not too much enough so it is very difficult or difficult or say you can say impossible to increase the font size how we can tackle this issue you can see that i have written only one alphabet instead of the whole name so with reference to the earlier figure like this you can see i can write it here g a t h t preheat temperature e d electrode diameter and r g i cannot i can't be able to edit the whole wordings so what should i do this thing can only be tackled when I write this as GA and then PHT, then you can say ED and after that RG. So you will please take care of it while doing the analysis for the first time. 
so in order to change these names i have to pro i have to again generate the whole design takuchi design now you can see i have given the name g a p h t e d and r g to my input parameters once you have make the design based upon these names you can't edit them because if you have edited them you uh, will not do the analysis correctly then so please make sure do it correctly for the first time whenever you are doing so now when i'm going to click on it g a or you can click on any one of it uh, g a p s t e d r g it's it is same click on the font then select the 16 and after that you click on okay so you can see the font size has been changed to 16 after that click on this line so make it custom then uh, the line type is continuous it's okay fine color automatic i need blue okay fine just increase the size to the 5 and click okay so we'll work on these circles so click any of the circle make it custom you can select this color and increase the size to 3 it is the most optimum for the graphs as my as per my suggestion and do it the same for all of them i am doing by pausing the video so that time will be safe so look at this the graph has been improved somehow now we work on these axis ticks so go to the font and then select the size 16 please make sure click on this box apply same font to all tick labels click okay so look at this all of them the size of all of them have been increased after that for the y axis click means of means and then apply same for all then font click on 16 Okay fine click okay so improved then click on this central line double click okay this is okay dash one however change the color to the red okay it's uh, red and then increase the size to the 5 and apply same attributes to all reference line let's see what happened to it so click okay okay make sure that you have selected the color red then click okay so the color has become red the graph has been improved so much now two things are remaining you can see these are some grid lines are there and we have to remove them so that over graph will become so much pretty and attractive so click on any of the grid lines and then select show so you will unclick this show grid line for the major ticks and click okay so you can see the grid lines has been removed now what to do with these vertical lines again click on any of the vertical line so here doesn't come this, uh, that option so we will tackle it in a another way click on this custom and then uh, type you need uh, none so click on this none and just click okay so you will see that all of the graph has been improved if any one of you uh, want boxes there so you can click on it and you can change the box type as you wish so if i select this one and then the same color you can see the box uh, types has been changed so it's up to you if you have any question you can ask me via uh, comments in the youtube section you can contact me via whatsapp my email address has also been provided if you like the video please hit the like button subscribe to my channel and i welcome all of your queries anytime thanks a lot stay stay blessed and bye